Hi once again, welcome back to the channel. Look, guess what we've got? Another e-bike review, but this one is an absolute cracker. In England we say, this is the dog's doodars. This is a really great bike. So this is the Himiway Zebra Step Through e-bike. And this is a really beefed up piece of kit. Absolutely fantastic. We've just been doing some trail riding with it. some road work but yeah really really great piece of kit love looking bike so stay tuned because what you're gonna see is us to tell you all the spec on the bike and we're gonna take it on a ride through the trails and some on-road uh, work as well the good thing about this bike is the range so it'll do 60 to 80 miles on one charge. Yeah, 60 to 80 miles. I guess the average being about 50 maybe um, for full on road use and hills and the rest of it. But um, fully charged to Himiway say that this bike can do 60 to 80 miles on one charge. So the range of it is fantastic. It's another fat tired bike. So without further ado, let's get cracking. <laughs> The weight of the bike in total is uh, with the battery is 35 kilos um, so it's a chunky thing but with a power assist modes it just eats up the hills it's absolutely brilliant it's got the five pedal assist modes zero through to five now the bike is limited to on-road use in the UK to 15.5 miles an hour it handles really well it's got the really chunky um, 26 inch wheels with a four inch fat tires on it and they're nice and dimpled so it's good for road use came here on the road with it um, which was brill uh, and then used it in the woods here on the trails <laughs> And it, it just um, the grip on it is brilliant but the good thing is when you first start off with it just engage the throttle in pedal assist one and it just gives you a lift for that first couple of miles an hour but that little bit of assistance with the throttle to get you going is super stuff um, so if you're on a bit of an incline and you can also use that if you're going to push it um, I pushed it a little bit on an incline and just engage that and that just helps you up the hill with it we've removed the front mud guard and uh, just because it looks a little bit more sporty um, but you can see it uh, here also with the mudguard attached you can also take the rear uh, mudguard or fender off it and the rear rack as well and then it's full on sports mode it's got the really powerful front and rear lights uh, and the brake lights also where you engage the brake light you can see them uh, you can see that coming on the rear it's also got the reflector on the rear as well which is good stuff it's got the seven speed Shimano gears um, which are really easy to activate the screen you can see here you can toggle up through the different modes on it and the great thing about this screen it's also got a backlight um, for use at night and underneath the screen is a USB port so you can then actually charge your phone from it as you go in if your phone if you're out on a ride and your phone gets a bit low on battery plug it into the USB uh, on the back of the screen and therefore you're going to get charged you're going to charge from the onboard battery in the bike it's got a 350 watt Bafang brushless motor um, so they've really beefed up the motor on this one so the frame is full aluminium so it'll take really good weights if you have both racks on there you could really load up with cargo on the back it's got tektro hydraulic brakes and um, so they've again that's an upgrade on this model and when i braked um, with it really really sharp braking the front forks uh, have an adjustable damp out on them so by uh, altering the dial on top of the forks you can uh, just um, get the dampness uh, for whatever whatever use you're doing it on the trails obviously you can uh, increase the dampness if you like and then on the roads just uh, dial it down so that's real easy to get to as well really like this bike the other good thing is as well as detaching the battery to charge it you can actually charge the battery on the frame there's a socket on the frame for you to just attach the charger directly there the battery is easily detachable there's a lever which just locks it in place it's fully flush to the frame as well 
You can see it's got this really chunky top tube which makes it a really good looking bike. <laughs> So what do we think to this one? Uh, well, yes, um, brilliant, what can I say, just brilliant, good fun, yeah actually no, better than good fun, it's great fun, just a perfect ride, perfect, really enjoyed it, easy to use controls, felt really solid, gears were great, so brilliant, I really enjoyed it, it's better than brilliant, it's a great ride I loved when you start off if you put it in power assist one and then you just twist the throttle here which only works in power assist one and it's just as a little aid to get you going just starts the motor and gives you a, some forward movement and then um, you can just use it as normal I took it up to um, power assist four coming through there yeah, so the, the, the little twist of the throttle to get you going only works to get you going and then once you've come out of power assist one and you go to two, three, four or five, it's just as a support to get you moving, which I really like. Um, and also in walk mode, I notice when you're walking yeah. uh, a little bit with it and pushing the bike, you can engage um, power assist can, one yeah, and, twist and, this and just, it'll just twist the throttle a little bit and that just helps you up the hill with it Yeah, uh, if you're on an incline. I came through there um, and I got up to power assist four but even if you are doing power assist four and five the brakes are really responsive. I like the fact that it's got the light at the back, the rear brake light, I think that's really really helpful. And um, it sexily says Himiway in the middle of it. It does sexily say <laughs> Himiway in the middle of it, yeah. The, yeah, really powerful um, light on the front as well. It, yeah it is, yeah you can yeah. see me coming can't you? Can, definitely. <laughs> um, I know you're coming. <laughs> <laughs> yeah sorry, probably make a little too much noise. The um, Shimano gears, um, really easy to use, uh, up and down, you've got the um, the flick switch here and you've got the button there to take you up and down great um, lights easy to operate the bell is a little cute bell not a huge sound but it it, it works and it's easy to get to um, I've not locked the forks out but we could do if we're on a road and I might do on the way back I think it's 16 mil of suspension so that's really good I like the step through you can get on it. and off it in a flash really if you need quickly. to do, yeah, really yeah, good. Yeah, definitely. Tyres, great, really solid. They were really good on this terrain. It didn't worry me the fact I was going over a few tree stumps or a few roots that were sticking out. In summary, this one's for me. This is my bike, I think. I might have to fight Michael for it, I think but I'll give him a good fight. For the first three people who order the Zebra Step Through from Himiway, there's a £200 discount. And then beyond that, there is a £150 discount for every person who orders the bike uh, direct from uh, Himiway. These discount codes can be found in the video's description and don't forget to use the Cruising on the Border link to avail yourselves of this fantastic discount. Good luck. The bike was really well boxed uh, and well packaged in there. It was all completely secure with really good quality packaging uh, to make sure no damage. Once we got it out of the box, we just removed all the foam uh, wrappings from it. It came with a really good accessories box with all full instructions on how to assemble the bike and even a multi-tool in there and a free hat. Uh, it's got a quick release front wheel, so it's great for you to put in the back of a car or a camper van if you've gone on holiday. Uh, it's easy to attach the pedals. It comes with all the spanners and everything you'll need for that also. And there it is, completely assembled. Easy peasy. Well, we wait.
it's hard on tight 